Welcome to Foxtech. Today we're talking about how to limit or even completely stop Wi-Fi access for WhatsApp on your iPhone. Now, if you've used an Android before, you might know that it's pretty straightforward to block Wi-Fi for specific apps there. But on an iPhone, things are a bit different. We'll have to use a few workarounds, but don't worry. I'll walk you through everything you need to know. The first and most direct approach is to open the settings app on your iPhone, then tap on Wi-Fi. You can toggle off Wi-Fi here to disconnect from any network, but keep in mind this will affect all your apps, not just WhatsApp. If you want to go even further and block cellular data for WhatsApp specifically, head back to Settings, then go to Cellular. Scroll down until you find WhatsApp in the list and toggle it off. This will stop WhatsApp from using cellular data, effectively blocking internet access if Wi-Fi is also off. Another useful option is setting up a Siri shortcut. You can create a shortcut that automatically turns off Wi-Fi when you open WhatsApp. To do this, open the Shortcuts app, create a new shortcut that turns off Wi-Fi, and then set up an automation that triggers this shortcut every time you open WhatsApp. This way, whenever you go into WhatsApp, your iPhone will automatically switch off Wi-Fi, and if you want, you can even add a step to switch to mobile data instead. It's a smart way to control connectivity for WhatsApp without affecting other apps. You can also use screen time to limit WhatsApp's internet access indirectly. In settings, select screen time and then go to app limits. Tap on add limit, choose the social category and select WhatsApp. By setting a daily usage limit, you can indirectly control WhatsApp's Wi-Fi usage. This is a helpful trick if you're trying to reduce your time on WhatsApp too, as it will remind you when you're nearing your limit. Finally, there's always the option to turn on airplane mode from the control center. This will stop all network access, including Wi-Fi, for WhatsApp and any other app. It's a quick solution if you want to go offline entirely without diving into the settings. And that's how you can manage or even block Wi-Fi access for WhatsApp on your iPhone. Thanks for watching. And if this helped, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to Foxtech for more helpful iPhone tips. See you later.